ESP01 is an inexpensive and versatile microcontroller with built-in Wi-Fi. It makes use of the widely used ESP8266 microcontroller chip. In this video, I'm going to show you ways to program the ESP01 and by the end of the video, you should be an ESP01 programming expert. Small little disclaimer though, the methods shown in this video works for me and your mileage may vary. Just make sure the voltage supplied to the ESP is 3.3 volt and you will be okay. Do post your question and comment in the comment section and whoever that knows the answer may answer them. With that out of the way, allow me to start with the theory of ESP01 programming. There are three main steps. First step is to put ESP01 into programming mode by pulling down GPIO0 to ground, then do a power cycle or reset. This will bring the ESP into UART mode. Second step is to send the binary through the serial pins of the ESP01. I will use the computer and USB to serial adapter to do that. Third step is to do a power cycle or reset. The ESP01 should be in normal running mode. You just need to make sure the GPIO0 is not connected to ground during the power cycle or reset. I'll demonstrate a few ways to leverage various USB to serial adapter that you may or may not be aware that you have. There are many development boards in the market that came with the USB to serial chip like CP2102, CP2104, or CH340, as shown in the yellow little boxes. In order to reuse this little USB to serial chip for ASP01, the microcontroller on board must be disabled. Usually, the development board will come with a special pin that allows us to either disable or put the microcontroller in reset mode. If there is no such pin, such as the one from Vmos D1 Mini, I will show you a little hack that can disable that microcontroller too. When it comes to component needed, you can go with bare minimum or go with all these optional components. The difference between them is just ease of use and higher chance of success. Program using Node MCU or similar development board. Pause the video to see the wiring in details. I'm using ADA Fruit ESP8266 and this is the wiring diagram. For Node MCU, the pin layout is slightly different, but the connection is the same. Program using ESP82 dev kit. This is the wiring diagram. Let me zoom in so you can read the pin name. Program using Vmos D1 Mini. D1 Mini does not have the enable pin pull out, so it needs a little bit of hacking. Connect the third pin from the left top to bottoms to ground and to disable the onboard ESP.
program using FTDI or USB to serial with auto reset. This connection supports auto reset so you don't have to manually push any button before or after programming. Program using FTDI or USB to serial without auto reset. Some FTDI does not come with DTS or RTS pins, so manual reset button is required. Program using Uno with most optional component. Program using Uno with Logic Level Shifter. Program using Uno with Voltage Divider. Program using Uno only. There are a lot of other videos showing how to do it, so I will just show the wiring diagram and skip the actual process. Extra note to point out though, if you are worried 5 volt Uno talking to 3.3 volt ESP will damage the ESP, here is the clarification from the ESP boss himself. He said the ESP IO is 5 volt tolerant. 
he didn't put this in the ESP specification document because often people misunderstood the ESP is fiber tolerant when only I.O. is. Program using Nano only. Revisit Uno chapter if you have concern using 5V on ESP I.O. This is the wiring diagram. Again, there's many videos out there that shows the process. I'm going to skip this too. When it comes to uploading the binary, I do see several retries are needed. So all I can say is good luck. That's about it for this video. I'm sure there are a lot more ways to do this. Do comment below to propose new way to program or to help others. And that's the end of my video. If you think this is interesting and it helped you, do consider to donate to Ko to JK. Thank you very much to support me. Hit like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.